Welcome back. Our eighth hero this afternoon. A nonprofit is using art to help those experiencing poverty and homelessness. It's called Gather Make Shelter, and it hosts workshops teaching people about painting ceramics. We're going to learn more about this organization with founder Dana Lewis. And you brought some beautiful pieces of art here, Dana. Welcome this afternoon. Thanks so much, and thanks for having me. Yeah, so tell us about the idea. You started this months ago. Yeah. But how does it work? So I started um, talking to social service agencies in October to see if they would be interested in doing this and to see if the population experiencing homelessness would be interested in doing it. And then I sort of started talking to potters all over town, um, professional potters and studio potters and people who are studying pottery at PNCA and Grant High School and to see if potters all over if town they wanted to help. would be interested in helping. Exactly. So, so they made so the they made these bowls. pots. Yeah. Okay. So they're made by hundreds of people all over Portland. These are beautiful. They're amazing. The inside, the intricate detail I in know. All of these. Some of these are pretty incredible. I mean, they're all really incredible. So then what I do is I take these pots into different social service agencies where the population experiencing homelessness has some some um, relationship already and actually I have two other sites too like right to survive is participating we're going to do their workshops in one of the volunteer agencies and then what happens is I teach painting and drawing and entrepreneurial skill building relative to ceramics so they're learning a skill yes but then they can also make money while they're doing it yeah I pay them the, the, the project pays them $20 to participate. Wonderful. They also get a t-shirt. So it's a lot about us participating with each other and collaborating with each other as a citywide event that we're gonna host in the fall. And these bowls will be for sale. And you'll come, you'll buy a bowl, you'll tell your friends about it. And then the money and goes And the money for to... that goes to get people into housing. What a wonderful idea. Where did you come up with this? What, what kind of need did you see? I actually, I was really frustrated with a disconnect between people not seeing each other, not talking to each other, not mm -hmm. looking at each other. And it's not just the people that are housed and the people that aren't. People don't want to look at each other because you have a California license plate and you're part of the gentrification. I mean, all these kind just of disconnects population. all over yeah. town that are happening to people of different colors and backgrounds and people of different ages, people in a wheelchair, people on a bicycle. Mm -hmm. So I wanted to figure out some way where we can work together, cross-pollinate all of that and create something positive and also um, get people talking to each other and, and participating in doing something for the population experiencing homelessness. Do you have a piece you want to highlight today? Oh, there's so many different ones. I know, they're ones. all gorgeous. I know, I well, them. here's a good example. This, <laughs> is, um, this man's name is Michael, and he's never painted did or drawn before and I mean this is incredible that, that's wonderful right so we came I came in and I brought I bring a lot of art historical references with me too and I brought in um, some things of a Native American pottery and he just kind of hooked on to that yeah, these when are he just left great. he took a whole list of things that he was going to go to the downtown library and look up so the project so goes learning. beyond that yeah. right and, and you have so a book this, here yeah so this is our project logo it's called gather make shelter we're going to have t-shirts any minute. Um, really wonderful company in town um, donated 600 t-shirts. And does this have photos inside of the work? No, this is, is actually our, this is actually, I have another photo book too. Okay, great, but great. This is, um, this is the logo you'll be seeing around town. Okay, so you're biking down the Esplanade yep. wearing your t-shirt. You <laughs> see somebody getting up for the day, however they've spent the night. And you might stop and say, hey, me too, what are you doing? Yep, and so, just start that conversation. Exactly. You have a GoFundMe if people would like to donate to the to the cause. What's that? Yes, gathermakeshelter.org. And if you'd like to get, we're on Facebook too. And then you can hit me up on um, email, gathermakeshelter at gmail.com. Okay, and I know, Dana, that you mentioned that big event or a couple in the fall you're going to yes. have. So we will be tracking your progress and maybe we'll have you back on and we can talk about that. Okay, thank you, get the you details so much. Figure it out. So gather, make shelter. Dana Lewis, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Can't